being aggressive, winning the ball, getting on with the play. We have put him under pressure. We're here pitch side with Tiernan O'Kelly, you might remember he was our young fan of the week there a couple of weeks ago. He's going to tell us what he thinks of the game so far. How do you think it's gone Tiernan? Well, good for Ireland, they're winning 2 now. My dad's playing, he said he hurt his leg, so I think he said he'd come back on, but it's going well for Ireland so He far. missed a few chances, are so you going to give him a bit of abuse about that tonight now? Yeah, I think my whole team is as well, because my friend Shane over there on my team, um, he he's watching and he's him and his dad are going to give my dad stick tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. And what about you now? If he sends it to bed, so now you missed that chance, so you can't say anything to me now. Yeah. 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 And how do you think the game's going to finish up now? I Two nil to Ireland right now. Austria brought on a good keeper now. Um, I think um, maybe three one Ireland. Three one. Yeah. And your dad to get the third. Yeah. You reckon? Yeah. Okay. And as far as the game tomorrow, how do you think that's going to go? Ireland Austria. I think 2-1 Ireland. Goal scores? James McLean and Robbie Brady. You hear the hear first. Ireland 3, Austria 1 da tomorrow. David Alaba for okay. Austria. Thanks to Tiernan for coming on again. Always a pleasure, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Shane from uh, Dundrum Athletic. Yeah. Yeah. And Shane, what's your predictions of the game so far? Uh, good game, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. My, uh, my man is actually playing up front, so... He's missed a few opportunities, hasn't he? Yeah, he's missing open goal to start the game, so... <laughs> Have you had some stick in training now? Yeah. And do you play up front as well? No, I play right wing. Right wing? Yeah. With the dazzler with the scales, are you? Yeah. And uh, what do you think we'll finish up here? Will we will we see out the 2-0 win? Or yeah, I think Will so. we get another few? 
You might get one more, but I'd say you you win anyway. So. And what about tomorrow? Are you going to the game yourself tomorrow? No, I'm not. No? no. You'll be watching on TV? Yeah. Well, what do you think? What's the predictions? They win again. They win again? Yeah. And what score? 4 0. 4 0? That's mm. ambitious. Who do you think is going to get the goals for us? Don't know. No, mm. mix of everyone. Mm. Perfect, yeah. Shane. Right. It's great for having you on. We'll have you on, I'm sure, on the Young Fan of the Week sale, will we? Right, yeah. Okay. Perfect. Cheers, Shane. Right. See you later. See you later. Okay, we're well, here with all the, the girl fans here. They're going to give us uh, their thoughts on the game so far. How do you think it's gone? Good. Uh, and, uh, are you happy with the goal so far? Yeah. Do you think we Ireland could get a couple more? Yeah. How about yourself? Um, I think that they're playing really well and it's a tough game. And your dad's missed a couple of sitters there up front, <laughs> yeah. hasn't he? Are you going to give him a bit of stick about that tonight? Probably. Okay. And yourself there? Uh, it's quite fun to watch it and it's quite interesting, especially with, when I'm with my friends watching it. Oh, cool, cool. And how do you think it's going to finish up? Um, I think it's going to finish up very good. Okay. And yourself? I how think do you think the game's really, gone? I think it's really good, but I think uh, it's very boring when you're just standing here watching it because you have nothing to do. Is your dad not playing? Yeah, he is. Would you not be cheering him on? My dad's playing. I am too. See, all your dads are playing. Okay. Yeah. And as far as uh, the game tomorrow, are you going to the game? Yes. All of you? Yes. He's season ticket holders, yeah? Yes. Oh, very good. How do you think the, the game's going to go tomorrow then? Ireland very versus Austria? Good. 4 0. To Ireland? <laughs> yeah. Okay, yourself? Probably about 3 1 Ireland. Okay. I say 4 like 8. 4 0? Uh, 3. 3. Okay, there you have it. You heard it here first. Ireland to beat Austria, uh, no one's uh, picking Austria to win at all tomorrow, so three points for the boys in green, there we go. Yeah, big thank you everyone for coming up to support Ireland and Austria here in the Carolina Browns tonight.
Hello, welcome back to Irish Football Fan TV. We're with some of the victorious players from the Ireland vs Austria fans game. Skipper here, how did it go, Graham? Yeah, yeah, I thought we dominated in the first half, no, to be fair. Um, obviously, we got the two goals in the first half from that man there, yeah. two crackers now, to be honest. <laughs> but uh, I thought now, in the second half, they kind of creep back into it, and we'd uh, had a few more changes to make. Delighted uh, to get the win in the end. Yeah. And how did you think it went? Yeah, conditions were a bit different than the second half. We obviously were playing against a stiff breeze. Right there, ball was dropping in on top of our 18 air box, so a bit of pressure on, on, on the backs there, but. Uh, I thought we managed it well, managed the game. In the second half as well, when we got the ball, we put it on the ground. Got them moving and got them torn behind us. Which led to the tour goal with this man here again. Yeah. <laughs> After Kero, yeah, are you going to take all the plaudits? Delighted, delighted. No, I can't take all the plaudits, really. Can I? We're solid from the back, good in the midfield. And then I didn't score the goals by myself. Obviously, people were passing me the ball, like so. And I was just in the right place for the third one. The first two came handy enough in the first half. And then the third one, I was just happy in, in the right place at the right time. Like. Like all good goal scars from midfield. So exactly. <laughs> yeah. We do a few yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. Speaking of tomorrow, how do you think the games are going to go? Are the games going to go tomorrow? Uh, hopefully get a two-one yeah. win or a one-nil. We're not, we're not, we're not going to roll there at the moment, like you know. So uh, can't see us hammering them, like. But we'll, 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 we'll take a one-nil, a set piece or something. I'm certainly yeah. feeling a bit more confident about this game than I was with the Welsh game. I don't know what about where I was going into the Welsh game. I felt a bit apprehensive going into that in the talk. It could have been a banana skin for us, and we, we might have lost again. Yeah. Luckily that didn't happen, and we lost a couple of major players through serious injuries. But yeah. feeling a bit, I think even the squad seems a bit better. Yeah, yeah. even after yeah. the Uruguay game, yeah. seemed like a real confidence yeah. booster. Uh, listen, to, listen to them talking in the in the press conference and all. They seem they seem much more together in this game for for whatever the reason is. I'm not sure. You know? Okay, and as far as predictions, we we'll start with you, Graham. We'll go with two one. Two yeah. one. Yeah. Uh, goal scores. Yeah, uh, I go with Johnny Walters. I got with him to both of them actually. Two yeah. Yeah. So I, 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 I'd fancy a 2 0 win. I think Walters could, could come up trumps for us for two of them, yeah. I can't score tomorrow, like so. Got, uh, <laughs> Johnny Walters won the other, right? Well, we'll be down with the Aviva game, so if you see us, come on yeah, over. We'll be getting a uh, pre match reaction and after match reaction. Yeah, right? yeah, thanks, thanks very much. Thanks, 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 thanks.